<laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. T today I'm going to do a makeup look um, inspired by Adele's makeup. It's not the one in her hello video, it's actually, I think, was it a show or something she did? It's where she's got the bright red lipstick on. Just a disclaimer, I'm not a makeup artist and this is just my own spin on her makeup just before anybody starts saying, oh it doesn't look like her, but you know. Hey ho. So I decided to put my eyelashes and eyeliner on first only because I think it can be a bit of a, a struggle getting those on and I didn't want to do that in front of the camera. And just to let you know that they are just the sultry eyelashes from Primark which are a pound and I actually really like them because I don't go out that much anymore. They're just cheap and cheerful. The eyeliner that I used is um, the A... Echo? Echo? Um, I think it's a new brand and it's just their, um, what's it called, waterproof lash enhancing carbon black. It's, I really like it though because it's, it's really, um, thin. So I'm going to go straight in with the Pore Professional just to cover those nice pores. Get a blob of that. And now I'm going to use my new Giorgio Armani um, Luminous Silk Foundation. Um, and if anybody's interested, I'm in the colour 5. I'm just going to use my Beauty Egg, as Bella would call it. Just put a couple of pumps. If I'm looking down, it's because I've got a mirror down here with, my ta with a table with all my bits and bobs. And I've got a spot right under there. I mean, who gets spots under on your double chin? Right, then I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Instant Anti-Age Eraser Eye. And I've got the shade Light. I'm just going to do my usual triangles under the eyes. My tree. My cupid's bone just on top of the lip. And under the lip. I'm going to do the odd little blemish actually. And I'm just going to use my beauty blender to blend that out. Next, I am going to use my Derma Blend um, setting powder just because it gives me more of a matte look. So what I do is I just, because it comes with a little sponge, which I put on backwards so this stuff's at the back. I just pour it into the lid and it's like talcum powder. And then put this on the back of my hands and I just dub it all over. And yes, it makes me look really white, but it makes your makeup last up to 16 hours long. Well, that's what it says on the bottle. And to be fair, I do actually think it is a good one. I just let that cook for two minutes. And with the Real Techniques powder brush, I just buff it off in circular motions. Next, I'm actually going to do my uh, contour, of course. And I'm just going to set that um, powder that I put under my eye my concealer under my eye with the highlight brush from Zoeva and the 17 Define and Contour kit um, and I'm just going to use the lighter shade to do that. So, and then I'm going to use my contour brush from Real Techniques and in the same 17 powder I'm just going to get the contour powder because in the photo she's got really contoured cheeks so I'm just going to, but they're quite high contour cheeks and she really pops out the cheeks so I'm going to try that for you. Ouch, me back, me back, me back. I'm just going to go around the forehead and 
Finger on the cheeks, cheekbones, neck bones, whatever you call them. And then, because she's got quite um, a bum chin, shall I call it? A bit bad, but um, I'm just going to define that a little bit. Like so, and she's got quite a thin bridge of the nose where I've got quite a thick one, so I'm just going to go down slightly down here and just try and thin it out a little bit. Right, so next I'm just going to go in with my Sleek palette, um, which is in the shade Medium. And I am going to use the middle colour, which I'm not sure what colour it is. It's the middle colour, just to um, highlight a little bit and, uh, above here. Um, and I'm going to use the contour brush for that, just to dab it on. Like so. And next I'm going to use my NARS um, Luster um, Blusher. And I'm going to just take my buffing brush from Real Techniques just to put that on a little bit on the cheeks. Do the duck face, do the duck face, do the duck face. Next I'm going to do my eyebrows. Now she's got quite natural eyebrows. I, I think they're quite similar shape to mine really. And we've both got fat brown faces. So um, that's why I chose to do her. So I'm just going to use my Benefit Browsings just to shape out the brown, fill in any spaces that are gappy. she's got like quite pinky like us not much um i uh not much eyeshadow to be honest but i've got a clinique powder um pot that i had for ages 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 i think it was even my mum's beforehand so god knows it's probably still off but um it's called the color surge eyeshadow quad from clinique and it just looks like this i don't know if you'll be able to see because my camera's playing up today and um, I'm going to go in with the colour 102 Spicy because it's a pinky colour. And I'm just going to put that over the lids because I think that's how she's doing it. That's how she's doing it. So and sorry, I'm using um, the Soft Definer Bamboo Brush from Zoeva just to do this. Do is I'm going to use my Naked 2 palette from Urban Decay of course and I'm just going to use the colour Verve on my lash line just to brighten that up a little bit. And she looks like she's got a little bit more of a, a pale colour under there so I'm going to use Booty Call from there to define the eyebrow. Like so. Right, I've got my mason jar here. Oh, here we go. I've got, um, this is a winged liner from the Zoeva collection as well. So I'm just going to put a little bit of that spicy colour underneath as well. Like that. 
now I'm just going to put a little bit of mascara on the bottom because she looks like she's got a tiny bit. And this is my Wilco's. If any of you aren't from the UK, I'm not sure if we've got Wilkinson's anywhere else in the world. Um, but they do their own mascara and I just absolutely love it. I think it's like £2 something. And I haven't had a bad mascara day since using this. And it's the Essence I Love Extreme Crazy Volume Mascara. Apparently, it's supposed to be the same as um, YSL. And finally, I'm going to do her lips because they're a red lip. And I've got two red colours. One's really dark, the Matte Diva. And um, then I've got Russian Red. Um, but she looks like she's got a bit of a darker colour in the corners of her mouth. I've got the Kiko Milano Smart Lip Pencil in the colour. What colour is it? 703. I'm just going to line my lips. I'm going to actually use one of my. Just to. <gasps> I'm finished. <laughs> um, right, so I'm going to go in with the fire and uh, the Russian red first just to see how that goes. You know something, I'm not actually going to do any more with that red lipstick because I am a disaster when it comes to lipstick so I'm sorry if it's all out the lines but I don't know, I quite like this look actually. I'd wear it on a night out obviously with sorting out my lips. Um, but yeah, this is my take on um, Adele. Um, I just curled my hair really slightly and it looks like she's pinned it back to the one side this side so I just decided to do the same thing um so yeah i hope you enjoyed guys thank you so much for the support and um liking and commenting on some of my photos it's lovely to hear from you all um so thanks guys bye bye